Guys, it's official. The Might Head Golden Ticket is Lamar Jackson. And of course, tomorrow you can go ahead and vote for his upgrades and for his chemistries. Now, I'm going to say real fast is that I know a lot of people are confused. How did a rookie player get a golden ticket? I thought that that was one of the stipulations. You had to be on the roster last year. That was a stipulation for anyone trying to make Colin Kaepernick. I mean, at this point, I'm not, you know, trying to stir up anything, but you can't really deny the fact that they made that stipulation for Kaepernick because they let Mutthead make a rookie player. And there was three quarterback rookies on the list for, you know, the golden ticket voting. So again, the fact that they just let, you know, my head make a golden ticket rookie shows that the only purpose, the only reason to have that stipulation on the list was because of Kaepernick. And again, whether you're against that or you're for that, that is, you know, something. And that's why that was a thing. So anyone who's confused about the whole rookie thing, that's the reason why. Because they knew Mutthead wasn't going to put Kaepernick on the list. Um, nonetheless, though, 20.8% of people voted for Lamar Jackson. So hopefully he has 90 plus speed. Hopefully he is a very, very good quarterback. Obviously, they're going to let us vote for his abilities, his chemistries and abilities tomorrow. Uh, and his ratings upgrade tomorrow. So that's going to be very exciting. Definitely can't wait to go ahead and get him um, on my team and play with him in this game. Now, I have to say one thing is, and I'm not trying to complain here, but this is really disappointing on EA's part. Madden comes out, Madden 19 comes out August 7th or August 10th, depending on what version you get. These golden tickets are going to come out if, you know, this is voting tomorrow, unless this right here, unless this, you know, golden ticket Lamar Jackson, Mutt Hit Edition, unless this comes out after the regular golden tickets or they do like a batches of 10 for like two and a half weeks. This is going to be really disappointing that we might not get golden tickets to either next weekend or maybe the weekend after that, depending on what happens. We have like, you know, two months before Madden 19 comes out. I mean, they should have released golden tickets back in March. Maybe, uh, I believe last year was March too. So yeah, sometime in March. Early March, we should have got golden tickets. We should have got the players mid-March or the end of March. They knew when the dev or when the Madden 19 was coming out. The fact that they didn't go ahead and release golden tickets earlier and they made them so late. And then beyond that, you know, the game. Madden has never come out this early, I don't believe. It's always like the 20th through the 30th in that time range. The fact that it's coming out as probably the earliest has ever been released in Madden history. And then we have golden tickets very, very late. I, I get it. EA wanted to extend this game as long as humanly possible. It makes sense because they want to make the most money and they want to keep the fan base playing the game as long as humanly possible. But the fact of the matter is you can't, they, this is just stupid because now it's like everyone, you know, who pull for golden tickets or who are going to pull for golden tickets, you can't use them for that long. And if they release them in March, like they did last year and previous years, we would have March, April, May, June, July, and then maybe a little bit of August. So that's five months to play with these golden tickets. Instead, we have two months, about uh, about 68 days to play with these golden tickets. And that's if they release them this weekend. If they release them next weekend, you have cut that down to about, you know, what? One and a half months to play with the golden tickets. So very disappointing EA's part. Um, obviously, I did make a video about Mr. Muck Coins information, about Memorial Day promo. Doesn't look like that's going to be a thing. Uh, golden tickets this weekend. That also looks like to, it's going to be incorrect. So probably not going to use that source for any information in the future. Uh, as you guys know, I love to go ahead and bring any information I know of to you guys. Any kind of updates, any kind of news, any kind of leaks, anything like that. Just to get you, keep you guys informed on what's going to happen. Now always, is that information always 100% correct? No, but the one thing is, and I try my best to do this. If I don't know 100% something's correct, I always try to tell you this is not confirmed. And if I tell you this is not confirmed, you know, that means don't panic. Don't think this is happening. Just keep it in the back of your mind that this could happen, but don't push too far with it. Now, if I say this is confirmed, I will always make sure I try to make sure that if I say it's confirmed, it's 100%. I have factual evidence to back myself up and I actually have, you know, information to show you guys what is happening. But... Nonetheless, it's kind of disappointing that, you know, that wasn't correct because I was thought this weekend was going to be awesome. We have a free UL this weekend with the um, 
What's good? If you're following up with the giveaway set um, on Mutt, we have Double XP Weekend again. I thought Golden Tickets. I thought Memorial Day promo. Yeah. And also, guys, a lot of people are asking, the fifth legend for the greatest of all time is Terrell Owens. That's the that's the last guy. Terrell Owens is the last guy. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe button. Sorry I ranted a little bit in this video, but kind of just disappointing with how this whole golden ticket, you know, thing went down. And I saw a lot of people commenting, how do they make a rookie? Well, that's how they made a rookie. Thank you guys for watching. Peace out.